good, y'all boys? It's your boy, Chef King, Chef Shalom, back in the building. I'll praise to the most high for another day. Hopefully, you best been out there grinding, you know what I mean, handling business, doing what we're supposed to do on the regular. But, hey, let me rap with y'all boys real quick, man. Hey, man, you reap what you sow, bro. I'm going to just be 100 with y'all boys, be 1,000 with y'all brothers in this video. Or sisters, if you're watching this video, you reap what you sow, bro. So, if you out here... Uh, doing and moving shysty and want to be sneaky and all that, bro. You reap what you sow. So when bad things come upon you for them, them, them bad things you was doing, don't don't cry to the Most High. Don't complain. Don't say woe is me. You know that these bad things have fallen upon me, bro. Because you allowed this and you caused this to happen to yourself, bro. Don't nothing just happen by chance or or just by coincidence, bro. You know what I mean? If you've been out here moving funny. Whether you've been stealing from people, cheating on your spouse or something like that, uh, shit, just getting over on people, when those things come back to you or something bad happens to you or you even lose your life, you can't complain about it, bro. Because, like, the vengeance is of the most high, for real, for real. And it ain't really no level of, well, I only took a piece of candy, why am I eventually going to jail? You Like, the most high move how he move, you feel me? So, like, it's better to do good things and then good things will come up and fall upon you, you know? The more good things you do, and I ain't telling you you gotta be no goody two-shoes and and just, uh, you know, I love everybody, but like, you move how you supposed to. You be positive, bro. You ain't gotta mean mug everybody. Like, you, you putting good energy out, you feel me? People who need help, if you're able to help them, help them. You know, that allows good things to come your way. You stay positive with your thoughts, bro. Stop having them negative thoughts. If you're watching something or listening to some certain music and it's causing you to have negative thoughts in regards to whatever it may be, causing violence upon your people, uh, shit, dealing with these women who ain't on the same type of time you on, you know what I mean? Don't feel no kind of way when those negative things fall upon you don't cry about it when the girl who you know what in on your type of time she play you don't cry about that because you should have been able to you know see that shit but you you so busy getting caught up with the negative thoughts in your mind those played out into your reality same thing with being positive bro like i said you keep putting positive vibes in the in the air in the atmosphere bro you have you you say positive prayers you ain't trying to look for no smoke you know what i mean you're able to you know interact with people in a positive manner those good things are gonna come your way but they ain't got no choice nobody does positive things and gets negative results nobody does negative things and get positive results they may look like they positive results like for example the brothers who are out here and this ain't no knock on y'all but we we me and you both know this shit ain't this shit ain't real bro that shit ain't real brothers who sell you know drugs to their community and i'm talking about like that harsh stuff like crack cocaine heroin uh molly and all that other foolishness them type of brothers who sell those things to the community bro that shit ain't it ain't no benefit out of that that shit is poison you low-key killing people you know what i mean i get it you 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 feel as if you're doing this to obtain a certain status or you're doing this to provide for your family. But I will say this, we in 2022, bro, if you take that same ambition, that same drive, that same focus you have to flipping them, them, them ounces and whatnot, them keys, and put it towards something else, same type of mentality, but put it towards something else, bro, you'd be great. Because if you if you're decent or good at selling drugs, bro, you could you could be an entrepreneur. I mean you could be a businessman and sell whatever. Positively. So if you put in negative things in the atmosphere, i.e. selling those drugs, don't be mad when people come rob you. Don't be mad when people are trying to take your life. Don't be mad when you go to jail or you feel like you got a monkey on your back. You always got to look over your shoulder. You feel me? That's coming from being negative and putting negative stuff in the atmosphere. If you take that mentality, you take that hustle, that drive, like I said, and put it towards something positive, that's when you get positive, you know, you get positive outcomes. So... You, 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 instead of you selling drugs, you out here selling products. You out here selling hair care and beard care products. You feel me? And that allows good things to come your way. People might want to collab with you. People want to try your product. People refer your product. You making money that way. The sky's the limit. And you doing something that's legal. You doing something that's positive. 
So I just wanted y'all brothers to keep that in mind, bro. The, the, you reap what you sow. So you put bad shit out here, you gonna get bad shit. Even if it look like good shit, it may be, it might be shit wrapped up in a gold bowl and it look good, but best believe, bro, that's still shit. Vice versa, if you put good things out in the atmosphere, you're going to receive good interactions. You're gonna have good outcomes. You know what I mean? Y'all boys, y'all boys stay positive. You keep the most high first. All praises to the most high. This your boy King Chef Shalom. If the message applies to you, you charge it to the game. If it don't, you keep it pushing. Shalom, y'all boys.